Hello and welcome to WP MU Dev, your all-in-one WordPress platform. In this video, I'm going to show you how to bulk install plugins in WordPress. If you build lots of WordPress sites, installing the same plugins into every new site you build can become pretty tedious and repetitive. Wouldn't it be great if there was an easy way to install the same plugins into every site you build? You'd be as excited as this guy, wouldn't you? Well, there is. I'm going to show you how to install multiple plugins in WordPress using a free plugin called WP Core Plugin Manager. Okay, so for this video, we're going to install uh, this plugin, WP Core Plugin Manager. But before we do, what we have to do first is set up an account at WP Core. And the reason for that is because the first thing we need to do is build a plugin collection. Uh, so that means a list of the plugins that we want to install in our WordPress sites. And once we've built this plugin collection, we'll be able to then upload these plugins into every WordPress site we build using the WP Core Plugin Manager plugin. So the first thing you need to do is if you haven't got an account, uh, head over to wpcore.com and just create your free account. Now I've already created an account, so I'm just going to log in. Okay, and once you've created an account, uh, come to new collection and let's create a collection. So basically a, coll a plugin collection is just a list of the plugins you want to install. So we're going to give a name here. We're going to uh, create a collection of WPMU Dev's uh, free plugins. So give yourself a description. Once you've done that, choose whether you'd like to make your collection public or private. If you make it public, you can share it with other people. Uh, private, it's just for your own use. So in this case, we're going to make it public. Uh, click continue. Okay, now you have a choice of installing WordPress plugins or your own custom plugins. Now, to install custom plugins, you actually need to choose one of the paid plans. Uh, we're just doing, uh, we're just going to use the free option. So all we're going to be doing here is installing uh, plugins from the WordPress.org uh, plugin repository. Now, the important thing to just keep in mind here is this little key. We're going to need this uh, when we start uh, building our WordPress sites and adding our multiple plugins. So just keep that in mind because we'll come back to this. Uh, for now, let's just click here on the add WordPress plugins. And then all you have to do is you just search Start typing the name of the plugin. Uh, when it comes up on the menu, you just click add and it adds it to your collection. Okay, so we're just going to go through, add another one. So click add, so now you can see we've got two here. Another way that you can add plugins is to go to browse and click on WordPress plugins. Then a whole list of plugins comes up and you can basically search. So you can search for plugins here. And then you just click on the add button. Choose your collection. And there we go, we've, we've added this another plugin. So I'm just going to go ahead and I'm just going to finish adding all the plugins that we have into this collection. Okay, so here we are. I've added all of the plugins, uh, the free plugins that we have. Um, this one is not one of ours, so let's just get rid of this one. And here we have all of the free plugins from WPMU Dev added to our collection. Now we're going to add these plugins to a new WordPress site installation. So first thing we need to do here is just select this key. This is a collection key. So copy it to your clipboard. And now we'll go to our WordPress site and go to plugins, add new. 
search for WP Core. There's the plugin here, so we're just going to install it. Activate it. Okay, so it adds an item to the menu. So click on WP Core menu item. And now we come to the screen, to the, the plugin collection screen. So all we need to do here is click add a collection key, paste in the key that we've uh, uh, copied over from the WP Core collections uh, area and click save collections. So now you can add another collection if you want to, or we can just install the plugins that we've just uh, imported. So let's just go ahead and install these plugins. So click install plugins. And now what we have to do is we can install each one. Or just do a bulk install. Okay, and now that we've actually installed all of the plugins, just select them all again if you want to activate them. And let's go activate, apply. And now all the plugins have been installed and activated successfully. So, as you can see here, now I've just refreshed the screen and there are all the plugins installed. So we've just bulk installed uh, multiple plugins into a WordPress site. So for every site that you build from now on, all you have to do is follow the same process and just install the same plugin collection that you've created at the WP Core site. Well, that's it. I hope you found this video uh, informative and instructional and uh, thank you for watching.